Hello again, everybody, and yeah, <laughs> this is Rob, and again, I'm here with Chris Redfield, and we are attempting to finish the Resident Evil Remake HD on hard mode with a character I am not entirely familiar with. I had some technical issues with the last uh, episode, specifically the audio. I also had some technical issues at the start of the following episode, which is why I'm actually back in the save room rather than uh, where I was right after I finished solving that stupid painting puzzle. Anyway, not going to waste too much time. Going to get right back into it. My apologies, though. That was, that was just really obnoxious having to deal with that crap. But I have the shotgun now, so yay. And I'm about to go try and use the last... Uh, the last of this armor key up. And if I recall correctly... Yeah, forget that guy. Oh, you're just right there. Nope, missed me. There you go. You don't need that head. That, go in here. Oh, there's still more places I can use the armor key. Okay. Whatever. Okay, this puzzle again. Now, depending on how long this takes me, I may just fast forward through it because it's been a while since I've done this puzzle and I forget what the specific order is that I'm supposed to push all of these in. But we shall find out. Watch, I'll get it on the first try. I probably won't. Yeah, no, no, that's, uh, that is entirely wrong. That is 100% entirely wrong. Come on. Is that... Oh my god, really? Really? I hate you. I hate you so much. No! No! Get, get back in there. Okay. Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. Don't think I wasted too much time doing this. There we go. Okay. Cool. Yes. Da -da 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 -da. Push the button. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes, take the jewelry box. Alright, let's let's take a look at this thing. No, let's not press the switch yet. Okay. Yeah, all right. Press the switch. And... Press the switch. Yep, cool. Okay, so now that that's taken care of, I'm just going to run this back down to the uh, safe room so that I don't have to carry this stupid thing around. Hopefully I can sneak past this guy. I don't think I'm gonna... Excuse me. Ah. I'd like that back, please. Really? Can I... No. Awesome. So I wasted an herb. I wasted two shotgun shells. And I lost my defense item. That's just spectacular. So this playthrough's off to a really good start. Sweet. Anyhow. So yeah, um, I don't really know what happened last time. I think maybe the problem was that I was uploading something while I was also recording the audio for the last, uh, well, technically the second to last uh, playthrough that I was doing. I honestly don't... I don't know what happened, but it was... It was pretty awful. So, uh... Yeah, hopefully that doesn't happen again. I mean, it's weird, because I haven't had any problems with the microphone recording before, but that one particular one was just... kind of a mess. Oh, I remember what I wanted to do while I was here. Is there a guy over here still? No, I killed him. Okay. All right, so I'm just going to go use this wooden plank thing just to get it out of the way. 
but there's a set of rooms that I actually need to explore that I haven't explored yet. And I've already unlocked them, I believe. Yep. Unlit fireplace. Well, let's just fix that. No, over here. Okay. Aw. So warm and inviting. Yes, I will take the map. For all the good that'll do me. Cool. That just seems so ridiculous. Okay. So that requires the helmet key, which I do not have yet. Right. Okay. Back in the saddle. Hopefully I can find some more shotgun shells soon, because I am hurting for ammo. Freaking Chris. Freaking Chris and playing on hard mode. Come on. Tick, pick, pick that up. Okay. And over here. I think there's a green herb in here. I hope there's a green herb in here. Nothing in the drawers. Footprints headed straight through the bed. Okay, there's an ink ribbon. It's there. Yes! Cool. I will take that. Ah! Suddenly the menu's giving me more trouble than the zombies. Okay. And what the heck, I'll pick this up. Why not? Let me just fill my inventory before I go check out the other room, because that's totally not going to be a waste of time. Oh no, this is the... This is the B. This is the B puzzle, isn't it? Locked! Oh, for... Ugh. <laughs> oh, Chris. I hate you, Chris. I hate you so much. <laughs> You and your stupid tiny inventory and needing to get tiny keys. You're the worst. It's no wonder Wesker hates you. Oh, spoilers. Because, you know, I'm sure that's a shock to people. All right. Um... there and yeah I'm gonna have to do this I don't wanna but I'm gonna have to I don't want to leave that one stupid zombie up in that hallway because I know I'm gonna be going back there and if he mutates it's just gonna be unpleasant so when in doubt set him on fire okay Burn. Yes. yes. Burn. Burn. Cool. Now that he's all crispy. I wonder if I should go after... Oh. I can go... Uh-oh. Wait. Wait. No. Okay. You know what? I'm just going to go in. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to be reckless, because why not? And if I die, I can just fast forward. You. Chris Redfield. You. Alpha We're here to rescue you. Richard, what the hell happened to you? Chris, this place. Get your team out of here. Demons everywhere. Don't talk. It's... <laughs> The poison is slowly turning him into a Quake 3 character. The size of the bite mark is huge. It's not just any ordinary snake. <laughs> My word for it. <laughs> I don't believe you. I think it's ridiculous for you to say that it's not an ordinary snake. That seems highly unlikely in this house full of zombies. 
Oh, right. Now I get to do this. Okay. Okay, what's the best route to take? I uh, think... Yeah, okay. I Yes, I know where it is. I'm just trying to think of... Okay. I dump that because supposedly we run a little bit faster with empty hands, like I think I mentioned before. This should actually be a pretty easy... Uh, pretty easy run. Nope. Provided I can get down the stairs. Do, 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 do. Yeah, someone's life isn't hanging in the balance or anything, Chris. Just take your time down those stairs. Not that I have any particular love for Richard, but, uh, you know. Can't just let him suffer and die. That comes later. All right. Do, 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 do. Forget you. Oh. Oh, he tried to get grabby with me. That's not cool. Very glad I killed the zombie that was in here and burned him. Okay. All right. We're doing good. Do, 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 do. I will take that. And you know what? I don't need this thing in my inventory right now, so we'll leave that. And I'll, I'll take this because I might actually need it. All right. It depends. I mean, interesting thing. Um, I mean, I'm sure a lot of people watching this probably already know this, but uh, when you fight Yawn, which is the snake's name, which I actually think is kind of a cool name for a giant mutant snake, um, when you fight him the first time, you actually don't need to fight him. You can just run through and hello, goodbye. You can actually just uh, run up, grab the item you need, and turn right back around and leave. Which is what I intend on doing. Hopefully I won't get poisoned in the process. No, I don't feel like dealing with you. <laughs> there is a... <laughs> I have to save the, the uh, cannon fodder. Or rather, the zombie fodder. Gotta hurry, otherwise Rebecca will be very disappointed in me. I was about to say, like, I wonder why Rebecca's not going to get it, but then I suppose she is the medic, so she's probably, like, I don't know, doing some kind of vaguely medical stuff to him right now. Right. Nope, nope, don't get, don't get caught on the dressers. There we go. Yay! Hope this is what you wanted. Thank you. Well, it looks like he's still breathing. Now, Richard. Hang in there. <laughs> now this is the point where he talks about how he hates needles and starts screaming. No, I know he doesn't actually do that, but it'd be funny, you know. The shot is what would uh, freak him out when uh, you know he just got bit by a giant snake. He's just unconscious. Rebecca, it's not safe here. Let's get Richard to a safer place. <laughs> Get right. him to a safer place, a slightly safer place. Richard's doing well, Chris. He should recover soon. Good. He'll recover Richard just soon enough help. to get eaten. As soon as Richard gets better, we'll come after you. Rebecca, you okay with the gun? Yes. All right. I'm going to continue my investigation. Be careful. Wait. He's asking her if she's okay with a gun but not actually following up by giving her a gun, which implies that she already has a gun. So if she already had a gun, why would he need to know if she was any good with it? Because she's on the frickin' police special forces team. Whatever. Whatever, it's not like Jill's story makes any more sense. Nope, nope. Afraid not, buddy. Okay. Let's go deal with a snake. Hopefully deal with the snake. 
I could end up dying. I probably should have saved my game before I left. Oh well. It's not like I'm playing on hard or anything. Yeah, I'll be fine. I'll be just fine. Okay. All right, come on, up, up the stairs. Up the stairs. Okay. Running, 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 running. I should probably re-equip this. Okay. Oh man, really? <laughs> so that zombie was in there the whole time. Okay. And I think there's one. Yep, of course. Hi there. Boom. Oh, come on. I shot you in the freaking face. There. Guess I have to use this. All right. Anyway. Now that his giblets are all over the floor and I don't have to worry about him eating me. Can I... Locked. Ugh, of course. Always with the locks. All right, anyway. I think this is a good place to stop it since I won't be fighting a snake right now. So, thank you for watching, everybody. Hopefully this will, you know, this marks the beginning of a new era of no technical issues whatsoever, but we'll see. But again, thank you for watching. I'll be uh, following this up more in the future, um, hopefully not having any huge gaps in in uh, videos going up or anything like this past couple of weeks. Long story, I won't bore you with it. But I do have more planned. So again, thank you for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, any combination of those three. That'd be awesome. You know, no pressure. But thank you. And I will see you all next time.